A birth is always the beginning of a story, for the newborn naturally, but also for those who brought it into the world. It's the moment when male and female become parents. And as with humans, it's often the female who takes care of the young. Many of them are mother hens. <laughs> For the rooster, the birth of the chicks hasn't changed a thing. He carries on his life as a male breeder. <laughs> but sometimes it so happens that the innocent infant will shake up habits and start asking questions. Who's going to take care of me, mom or dad? animal world, many males do not embrace fatherhood. Most of them don't even know they have children. Yet there are quite a few remarkable males who readily assume their role as fathers, sometimes to an extreme. How and why do only some of them become good parents? These are the personal stories of 10 extraordinary individuals with scales, feathers, or covered in fur. 10 males who wear their super dad costumes with brio. Let's leave the rooster where he is, for now and head to the south of France and the saltwater marshes of the Camargue. Every spring, not one, nor two, but thousands of fathers-to-be flock here. These majestic pink flamingos are outstanding breeders, responsible for the survival of their species. For the rooster, as we just saw, the birth of his chicks was no big deal. He has up to 300 a year. The pink flamingo, however, has just one. And it's quite a different story. That's why flamingo fathers are ready to take on all the chores that mothers do to raise their one and only chick together. Some are already part of a couple. Others, still searching for their soulmate, join the great singles dance party. The goal? To find a female capable of laying an egg as quickly as possible. The job is done, but the festivities are over. Accompanied by the soon-to-be mother, our dancing father heads to the small, overcrowded islet. The latecomers must haggle for their precious square meter. A few hours later, and the egg is laid. At that precise moment, this ordinary male will transform himself into an extraordinary father. Close to the edge, he is extra vigilant. Because if, amid the bustle, an adult happens to knock the egg outside the nest, it will immediately be spotted by the carnivorous seagulls. Here, a flamingo chick, left unsupervised for an instant, has been scooped up by a predator. During the three-week incubation period, he never rests. As gently as the mother, Father Flamingo plays mother hen, providing heat with his featherless belly. Mother and father take turns brooding. Each one stays up to two whole days without leaving the nest, not even for food. 
As long as the young chick is dependent, the father provides a constant presence. When the chick is 15 days old, the father prompts it to join other young chicks in what is called a creche for flamingos, too. He'll have to catch up with the group fast. gathered together, marshaled by a few devoted parents. An enthusiastic father mimics a takeoff to train the older chicks. To ensure the growth of his young, the father must travel several dozen kilometers every day. He filters out the best nutrients from muddy marshes with his beak to feed himself, but also to make an energizing cocktail he'll provide his young flamingo. More robust than the female, the male is more capable of satisfying the growing needs of the infant. Whenever required, he provides an ultra-nourishing liquid from his beak. After three months, the young flamingo has had its fill. With a rosy future in sight, it is now strong and its plumage full. It is ready to take flight. Everyone takes off in a different direction. The family separates. And once again, the father becomes just another flamingo, among many others. For these birds, the sharing of parenting chores has been accomplished. Yet there is an entirely different species, where the male goes far above and beyond in the care of his children. It's a little-known monkey who lives in the forests of the Amazon. the coppery titi. In the wild, the species has almost disappeared. Since living protected in parks, like this one in the Vallée des Singes, the Valley of the Monkeys near Poitiers in France, they can be observed close up without disturbing the extravagant males who are very invested in their roles as fathers. And yes, the coolest of all cool dads is without a doubt this little ball of fur with a long white tail. He is calm, faithful, and affectionate. His companion, like him, is gentle and loving. Every year, they have a new baby. The most recent one is barely two weeks old. It's his father who carries him on his back. He keeps him on average of 20 hours out of 24, mindful of the tumbles of a still awkward baby. Among monkeys, he is the only example of the daddy nanny, devoted entirely to minding his children. Every day, same routine. Once she is finished nursing, the mother hands baby over to father, peacefully. Father loads baby onto his strong back, and daddy daycare begins all over again. Serene, the female spends these long hours of freedom eating and gathering strength, so she can provide milk that's full of goodness for her baby. She takes advantage of her life, her friends. She knows her child is completely safe in the care of a babysitter she knows she can rely on.
The Kapari Titi's father's days are spent carrying a clutching baby still learning how to balance. Awaiting the comings and goings of the mother and coiling tails, a sign of shared contentment. In this protected area, time seems suspended for the Kapari Titi, as if life were in slow motion full of tenderness and well-being, and an awareness of his precious loved ones.